Hi guys, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to secure your router. First thing you need to do is to connect to your router. So this router that I'm connecting to doesn't have any password. So it is very important that um, whenever you set up your router to put a password on it to prevent unauthorized access. So we're going to connect to the router. So it didn't ask for any password, so I'm going to show you how to set a password on it. So you need to click on system, then click on password. So it's going to ask you for, for the old password. However, there is none, so you're going to leave that blank and you're going to type a new password. Uh, this password should be secure. Well, a secure password mean it should have characters, should be alphanumeric. So you're going to click change password and your password has, has been changed. So we're going to test that. So we're going to close Winbox, open it again, and we're going to try and connect to the router without any password. So it is telling us that wrong username or password. So what you need to do now is to type your the password that you have set on the router and click connect. All right, and another access control feature is is users. So with users, you can create an account for someone to access your router and with this account you can also limit their access so you're seeing that this router only has one account name admin which has full privilege so say for instance if you wanted to add another user click add it will ask you for the username the group so really the group is really the the permission that is assigned to a party is really a set of permissions that are, that is applied to a group. So, in group there are a list of groups. So we have one named full, read, write, and each of these groups are assigned set of privileges. So before we create this account, I'm going to just show you a little bit, give you a little overview of the groups. So look at the groups. Mm. I'm going to expand this and so you can see it much better. So you have full access, you have read only. So the person will have access to these but won't be able to change anything. And write what exactly the person would have access to change. So in users, I'm going to add a user. So we'll call this user guess. And we're going to give this user just write read only. So we're going to give them a read privilege and you can set a password and you need to confirm the password and then you're going to click apply also you can also comment on 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 this account so you could say This is a guest user, and you could put read only, OK, and then click OK. So, so now we have created another user named guest. So let we let us test that. I'm going to close Winbox open it again we're going to use guess and we're going to type the password for that account and then click connect so we're now logged into the router as guest so up here you can see it. we're telling you that you're logged into the router um, account as guest so that is how you would secure your router in terms of from a, um, a login point of view. So thanks for watching.